Hello there and good morning. So everything in Nicola Sturgeon, Scotland is progressive and free, is it? Yeah. The SNP has an attitude of Scotland being a progressive place where everything is free. But that only applies, it seems, to some people, not everyone. But some people, the ones the SNP obviously don't want, are missing out. Here's what the director of Shelter Scotland said. When I learned that councils were asking our clients to leave jobs and family in the central belt to take up accommodation in England, I did a double take. Surely it has not come to this, that today in Scotland we appear unable to provide for the most basic of human rights, the right to a safe home. Yes, the homeless in central Scotland are being asked to move to the north of England to get help and I have to wonder how long this has been going on. And are they being shifted out of sight to virtue signal by making way for people from outside the UK, maybe? People that do seem to end up living on a ship. Now here's the thing. Homelessness across the entire UK fell during the pandemic after local authorities were instructed to get them off the streets and safe but homelessness is now rising again. And bear in mind, homelessness means on the street or in temporary accommodation or sofa surfing with friends and family. Now, according to Crisis, rates of core homelessness are substantially lower in Scotland, 0.57% of households, than in England, 0.94%, and Wales, 0.66%. So local authorities in England have higher homeless rates, but Scots homeless are being sent to England. And maybe that's why the rates are higher in England. Scotland gets 30% more in funding per capita via the Barnet formula than England does. And Scotland has higher income tax rates so that it can supply all that progressive free stuff that the SNP says that it wants to. So if England is taking the homeless from Scotland, then which are the real progressive ones? But all this leads to further division in the UK. So is there a quiet SNP policy to do just that? Nicola Sturgeon likes to put on a display that Scotland, under SNP administration, is capable of doing everything for itself. But this shift of the homeless into England is a firm indicator that they can't, and also an indicator of what its policy might be if they ever got independence. In fact, the Scottish Homelessness Service appears to be on the brink of failure. Now that I've had a pop at the hypocritical SNP, for balance I will point out that in 2020 councils across England were reported to be acting against homelessness guidance to keep people in their local area by shifting people about from English borough to English borough in their droves. And we all know why house prices and rents are so high and why there's a lack of affordable accommodation for those people, don't we? Why is it that some people can be instantly put up in four-star hotels with all the bells and whistles and end up with a nice house, while others are cattle-classed around the country into England and left to rot? <laughs> 